Looker 320. A commercial hydrofoil boat intended for sightseeing and submerged activities is called the Looker 320. Its big transparent bottom glass lets riders take in the underwater surroundings to the fullest. The boat has a hydrofoil design for excellent sailing and a 20-passenger commercial license. The interior is crimson, while the outside is white. For the convenience of the occupants, the Looker 320 also features a 60-liter fresh water tank. It is a part of a line of glass-bottom boats, the largest of which is the Looker 370, which has a panoramic transparent bottom glass measuring 2 by 3 meters. The Looker 320 is a popular choice for excursions and maritime sports, especially in the Maldives, because of its distinctive and eye-catching design. Wokart A watercraft called the Wokart combines the performance of a catamaran, the speed of a sports boat, and the agility of a go-kart. Dr. Albert Nazarov's asymmetric catamaran layout, which enables fast 90 degrees turns, a mid-mounted outboard engine for superb handling, a foot throttle and adjustable seat for vehicle-like control, and an outboard motor with 70 horsepower for up to 40 knots are some of its standout characteristics. Even in rough waves, safety is guaranteed by the robust Monaco construction created by the curved design. Because it is quieter and more environmentally friendly than jet skis, the Wokart is made to be enjoyed even in places where they are prohibited. Iguana Pro Designed for both land and marine operations, the Iguana Pro is an all-terrain amphibious boat that performs very well in a variety of settings. Because of its great speed and all-terrain capabilities, it is appropriate for security, surveillance, and rescue missions. It can travel at high speeds on water and reach up to 50 miles per hour on land because of its special mobility system. Options for personalizing the boat include paint, underwater, LED lighting, and integrated hardtops. Passengers can enjoy a comfortable and roomy atmosphere thanks to the open deck arrangement, which includes an electric head, seating all around, and a huge helm. Sea-Doo Rise E-Foil With its retractable handlebar, the Sea-Doo Rise is a unique all-electric hydrofoil surfboard that provides a dynamic riding experience. Riders can opt to stand, kneel, or lie down, depending on their chosen position. The board can be flown in half or fully deployed and ridden without foiling. Due to its wide front wing and motor or propeller module, it is easy for beginners to use and offers a nearly silent ride. The board is appropriate for a variety of riders because of its design, which emphasizes accessibility, simplicity, and quick charging. It is anticipated that all details and costs will be disclosed shortly. Rowboat 3 As a component of the robotic boat system, Rowboat 3 is a brand new autonomous surface vessel intended for urban transportation. It seeks to offer a cutting-edge approach to urban transportation while operating autonomously. For safe and effective navigation, Rowboat 3 is outfitted with cutting-edge technology, including water chemistry sensors, acoustic transducers, and high-resolution cameras. It belongs to the larger category of robotic watercraft systems and autonomous underwater vehicles, which are frequently created and tested in competitions such as the RoboNation RoboSub competition. The main objective is to offer a fresh and creative approach to passenger transportation and city navigation. Hydrofoiler XE-1 An innovative method of water transportation is provided by the Hydrofoiler XE-1, an electric hydrofoil bike designed in New Zealand. Its hydrofoil design allows it to rise above the water, giving riders an aquatic cycling experience. It has a top speed of 21 km per hour and a ride duration of up to 4 hours when powered by an electric motor and batteries. In addition, the bike has a specialized app for recording stats and Bluetooth connectivity. Weighing only 31 kilograms, its modular design makes it simple to assemble and transport in a car. The bike's design incorporates carbon fiber foils and buoyancy modules to provide stability and maneuverability on a variety of water surfaces. It can manage waves and turbulent water, making it suitable for riders of all fitness levels and providing an exciting and environmentally responsible ride.
Shadow Six Racing, an aquatic utility vehicle, AUV, called the Shadow Six Typhoon, was created by the motorsports defense and technology business Shadow Six Racing. The hybrid rig known as Typhoon is 10.8 feet long and weighs 2,365 pounds dry. Its two unique jet ski racing hulls are built of aerospace grade carbon fiber, and its body is composed of titanium and carbon fiber. Twin four cylinder supercharged Yamaha GP1800R SVHO engines, each producing 250 horsepower, power the Typhoon. Performance kits are available to increase the power even more. The Typhoon can carry up to three passengers and has a maximum speed of 68 miles per hour. Gibbs Quadski. The first sporting amphibian in history, the Gibbs Quadski, can travel 45 miles per hour on land and in water. It has four wheel disc brakes, a monocoque dual skin composite hull, independent coil springs, and hydraulic dampers for suspension. It also has a 140 horsepower engine and Gibbs jet drive with reverse. Stability is ensured by the lightweight construction on land and in the water. While they are no longer for sale, Gibbs Amphibians in New Zealand offers complete parts and support. Gibbs Bisky. With a single switch, the amphibious Gibbs Bisky motorcycle can go from land to water. This single seat HSA motorcycle has two jets and measures 2.3 meters long by less than one meter broad. It has a two cylinder gasoline engine that can generate up to 55 horsepower. It can travel up to 80 miles per hour on land and 37 miles per hour on water. The Bisky's maritime propulsion system includes Gibbs unique dual jet technology, independent coil springs, hydraulic dampers, and a monocoque dual skin composite hull. In addition to the Gibbs amphibians, the Gibbs Quadski was created by the same business in 2012. However, the manufacturer's website states that the Bisky is not currently for sale. Candela C8 A luxurious electric hydrofoiling boat, the Candela C8 is referred to as the Tesla of the sea. It is powered by a 69 kilowatt hour battery pack, and with a 120 kilowatt hour battery pack, it can travel up to 57 nautical miles. In inclement weather, its hydrofoils allow it to glide over waves for a smoother ride. The C8 is the first electric boat on the market that can hydrofoil and has a range comparable to a gasoline boat at faster speeds. Important characteristics include carbon fiber structure, electric and hydrofoiling, Polestar power, and a limited edition with a unique design created by Polestar's design team. With its quiet, smooth, and effective hydrofoiling experience, the Candela C8 is regarded as the boat of the future. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. See you in the next video.